Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be playing, oh my goodness, I'll be plotting the week of September 26th to October 2nd in my memory planner and I'll be using a kit from Screw Prince Co. called Once Upon a Fall. Um, so yeah, I really like this kit and this um, artwork actually came out last year um, and oh my goodness, why didn't I realize that I put two fashion girls uh, on the same side? I have no idea, but it's too late now. <laughs> um, I'm not going to move it. Um, is what it is. Um, so anyway, so pretty much I kind of like started on the bottom washi and then put down the date covers. Um, and I also paired this with the gold waves. I don't know what it's called. I apologize. I, I am very terrible at remembering like the foil bundles names unless it has the name on it. Although I should include my names on it. My mind is very easy. Literally snowflakes <laughs> or winter. Um, so I should put the names on it. I might shoot and change that um, up next time. So anyway, um, oh gosh, clearly lost my train of thought already. Um, so I guess I'll talk about like the base. Um, um, so I put three full boxes on the sidebar. Um, and yeah, pretty much. Um, this is the week that after I came back from my Charleston trip. Um, and let's just see. Say, oh my goodness, let's just say this was an eventful week. Um. <laughs> to say the least anyway so um this week was actually when all the fall tv came back um back on these networks um so i'm very happy that there i finally have tv shows but then i'm like i should be studying but i'm not i love my tv <laughs> i don't know i'm just like struggling here um like i'm like studying but not as much as i should be studying anyway um so yeah that is pretty much the base um and oh and i forgot to mention that i put two full boxes on the side and um i did not even include a script i should create one that is just full black um so you guys can let me know um if you want the um what do you call it the pack order scripts that i use in my spreads um i do have those as version two scripts um and they're available as foiled um sheets and i'm debating if i want to make them like a larger size as opposed to the ones that I currently offer um but I think I'm gonna keep it as is <laughs> at the moment um and maybe if there's they're gonna be a version three then I will think about it uh but you guys can let me know anyway so um I usually don't even mention what I put on the sidebar so I'm gonna mention it now before I forget um because I usually mark that down at the end of the spread but I'm gonna mark it down or like talk about it in the beginning so pretty much on the first box I marked down that I watched or like fall tv is back um and then the second box I wrote down that I had got the bivalent booster um so this is the new booster shot that is available for I think adults older than 18 if I'm not mistaken um there's no like um like age restrictions at the moment um but Let's just say I had a really bad reaction. Me and my brother both had a very bad re reaction, but mine like literally calmed down the, like I would say the morning, the next morning. So yeah, I didn't really have a fever or anything. It was just hot and cold like um, feelings. Like I was freezing at night, even though I love the cold. Like I love sleeping in the cold. I just couldn't, I just couldn't sleep in the cold. So I had to bundle myself up in two blankets. Like, and it was like, it was a warm day too. Like, my goodness. I, I don't know. Um, also, I think, no, this was a, the following week, it was like raining nonstop. And I should have used a rain um, kit for that. But it's my cousin's wedding week um, or wedding celebration. Um, so I'm going to use the Planner Pixie Co. Um, kits from that. So anyway, so then for, I guess, I'll start the day by day now because I'm already starting like putting down things on the days. Anyway, so for Monday, I'm right down that I published. So, oh, and I forgot to mention that I published five videos this week. So I kind of like going back to my three day schedule. And then if I have extra videos, then I'll post them like when it is. And also this videos um, that I posted, <laughs> like I didn't even know what order I was posting it because I, it was just a hodgepodge of videos that I already had. And then I was like, my goodness, why isn't anything working? <laughs> um, so anyway, so then for Monday, I marked down that I published the weekly plan with me. I watched, um, I don't know. I never watched Keeping Up with the Kardashians, but I guess like now that it's on Hulu, um, I've been watching it 
watching it. So, anyway, I watched The Kardashians. Um, oh my goodness, there's an S in The Kardashians. Um, so, anyway, um, and then I watched The Masked Singer. Um, and those scripts, I don't know. You guys let me know if you would um, want them in the shop. And I was, silly me, I literally put down Med, Fire, and Pete. <gasps> oh, I'm so silly. I literally wrote FBI, Most Wanted, International. Wait a minute. Isn't FBI Most Wanted International on... Comes out on Tuesday. Why did I watch it on that day? Oh, no, no, no. That came out last week. Never mind, never mind. I got confused. Anyway, so, um, silly me. I put... I had a script for Med, Fire, and PD as a combo. Um, instead, for FBI, Most Wanted, and International, I did individual scripts for each of one of them, but... Like, if I know that they're all, like, in the same, like, category or, like, same name, I usually combine them, knowing that I just watched them, like, the entire thing throughout, um, like, that day. Anyway, so, I did not create a script for that. And I'm just, like, rambling at this point. So, anyway, so then, um, but those, um, like, TV scripts, um, that's, like, the new version that I created, and it's perfect for the little things because um, I can also fit two lines in it and I strategically make sure that it fits within the Scribble Prince Co's little things and it if you have other little things it I think Scribble Prince Co is like skinny but not too thick um, or not too tall if that makes sense um, but yeah pretty much it has enough spacing for like a icon and then whatever word or like script you use or whatever you want to write um so yeah pretty much um i did that so i created those over the, like the summer or like was it really over the summer no probably during the week after black friday because or not oh my goodness not black friday labor day <laughs> oh my goodness we're not even there yet um so yeah pretty much um yeah and then i marked down that i packed orders i watched the rookie um i caught up from the shows from last week so yeah because um the shows came out last week, but obviously I was in Charleston and I was exhausted and I did not watch any TV shows because I had no time, actually. And then I got my package from Scrubbins Co., which was my monthly subscription. Then I was exhausted that day, so I took a nap. Uh, and then now for Tuesday, um, and also this week we did not go to, into the office, or I chose not to go in the office because there's just a lot of things um, that I needed to get done. Um, and yeah, it was just too much. I was exhausted. Regardless, so then for Tuesday, I marked down that I published week 36, and then I watched Hawaii Five-0. Um, oh my goodness, Hawaii Five-0. That ended long, long time ago. Um, not really that long, but pretty much um, before the pandemic started. Anyway, so then um, I watched NCIS Hawaii, FBI Most Wanted, International SEAL Team, New Amsterdam, The Cleaning Lady, 911. Like, the amount of TV shows that I watch is insane, but... I just love it. Um, anyway, so then I marked down that I packed orders. Then for Wednesday, I, um, what do you call it? I published my October lineup. I originally was going to have this video up on Friday, but I didn't finish uploading or finish editing, um, or no, I didn't even film October monthly yet. So yeah, I had these like flopped around and yeah. Anyway, so then I, published or my goodness I already marked, said that um and then I went to the alumni office and actually took a day off on this day thinking that I was going to go to see Jimmy Kimmel live in Brooklyn uh, but my dad unfortunately had jury duty that day um so instead I made the best of it and surprised my co-workers or my old my former co-workers and my old former supervisors um uh, I only told two people that I was coming and my co-worker she's my friend uh so she's pretty much she was like what the heck are you doing here and i'm like surprise <laughs> um so yeah i surprised them um so i told my one of my my supervisors um he was actually in jamaica um when i came to visit the office so he was like out of all the days you came um you didn't even like why did you have to come this way i'm in jamaica i'm like i'm sorry <laughs> this is the only day i had a day off or i took a day off um so yeah, anyway, so then I marked down that I surprised my co-workers and my or I didn't have enough room to write supervisors, so they were pretty much my co-workers. Anyway, so then I watched Big Sky at a payday, and then I decided, um, since I had a day off, I was like, might as well return my Dyson. I literally had it sitting in a box, and it was just like, like, literally the box I purchased it in, 
like the original packaging I should say um and I was like I haven't touched it ever since I bought it or like I touched it the first day and haven't touched it since and I was like it's not going to be a good investment or like yeah so I ended up just returning it and got my money back on uh, although I had to pay 29 cents of interest that is my fault because I did not read the fine print um so yeah anyway so then um I marked down that um when my when I was walking my dog um my dog has a tendency of not liking other dogs and I don't know what happened like why he does it but it kind of needs to be corrected and I haven't had the chance to correct it and it's kind of my fault but he kind of reacts um negatively towards other dogs except when he sees his brother his so-called brother um so Kion. um so my dog he accidentally bit me when he was barking at this other dog um and like my arm was at the wrong place at the wrong time when I picked him up um and I was trying to calm him down because usually when I pick him up he's usually very calm uh I just don't know why he reacts so negatively to other dogs but yeah anyway um pretty much he bit me I was wearing a jacket so he didn't like puncture anything or like uh, like I wasn't bleeding or anything I was just very bruised right in that area so if you notice in my videos before uh, like this really dark area on my left arm like w like above where I watch um, my, where my watch is um, I ha kind of didn't cover it up but this video like I did cover it up um, it's because it was like very like it was not very pleasing looking but I can say now um, it's been or like when I'm recording this voiceover it's been a entire week um so pretty much um I I believe in herbal medicine like uh like there's something called ti da jiao um and like my uncles my like extended family doesn't believe in it but this is what my grandpa like he brewed this um and I've been ever, ever since I was little uh if I get a bump or a bruise or like a cut or anything I would use this and and I actually believe in it because it actually helps like makes it go away faster um I don't know there's something in it um, that does it but this is the last batch of my grand what my grandpa made and he's no longer like with us but yeah it's just like memories that this is what my grandpa made and it kind of helps me in a way um or like help me like heal like faster than if I just let it just naturally heal if that makes sense um so pretty much um like one week later it's like not as pur no longer purple it's just like there's just like some parts that are like still a little bruised inside but overall like it's gone um i don't really notice it as much um as of today um which is october 7th um so in this video will come out two weeks later um and i'm recording the voiceovers a little earlier so yeah pretty much my dog bit me and i i'm fine with it <laughs> i'm like like it wasn't his fault and it was kind of like my fault in a way because um my hand my arm was in the wrong place at the wrong time so anyway so regardless on thursday i marked down that i published week 37 then i packed orders i had a usps drop off um my dad dropped them off i believe right yes maybe yes my dad dropped them off and then i watched a bunch of tv shows i'm not gonna say them all then i designed um because they were pretty much the episodes for this week so i was trying to catch up so i won't be behind then for friday i marked down that i published october monthly then i gave my dogs their preventative me medication um and then i also took a half day off um or like no on thursday i worked a little longer so i kind of made up those hours for friday um and then for friday i had a doctor's appointment so um yeah i pretty much left early so then before that i went to drop off my packages um or no before no we went to chinatown and dropped them off there and my mom's like her old job that post office apparently she always had difficult time like they won't accept the packages because it's not this um the ship date um or like the today's date i usually like to make sure that they get um scanned in so i usually bring them to the post office the day before you would get a shipping notification because I use I sometimes know that post office like to take their sweet time um so I usually let them have like a day and then you get a shipping notification um so pretty much that is that um so I dropped them off and then 
um, we went to across the street and there was a Taiwanese pork shop. Um, so I really want, I, usually my parents get the noodles. I always get the rice. I, I'm always a rice person. So anyway, and then I marked down that I had a doctor's appointment and this was just a follow up for my cardiology, like the stress test that I took two weeks ago. Um, and there, the doctor said there was an abnormality, um, but it ended up just being nothing at all. Um, but ever since the stress test, I never really had that pain ever again. So it's kind of weird. Um, so I don't know what happened, but regardless, nothing's wrong with my heart. But um, I guess it's just maybe a blood vessel, like I always said, um, and my dad says. So yeah. Anyway, so then I watched CSI Vegas, and then I designed. Um, and then on Saturday, we went to Bow Mountain um, with my mom's side's family. So obviously my grandma is in Hong Kong right now. Um, so, um, my, both my maternal grandparents both passed away. Um, so we pretty much pay respects. It's like twice a year. Um, if you guys know what, I, if you know, you know, um, anyway, so pretty much it's Bow Mountain. Then we had lunch with my aunts and uncles. And apparently my uncle said that he's very proud of me that I got into my, like one of the big fours um so yeah he was like very impressed um and usually this uncle really pisses me off but i'm like thank you thank you uncle um so yeah anyway so then i did some shopping and returns since it was in new jersey um and then we also went to new jersey's bj's because the tax is kind of different um cheaper um and yeah um and then we i when we came back home, I watched New Amsterdam. Then for Sunday, I marked down that um, the 2023 planners are finally up in the shop. And then I also had new releases, which were like stickers and stuff. Um, and then uh, for lunch, we went to Galam um, or GLM, uh, but in Chinese. Like I'm kind of like branching out and saying like the words in Chinese. I shouldn't be embarrassed or like, like I always feel embarrassed like to say it because I feel like I'm not saying it correctly, but anyway, um, we went to GLM, um, for, like, it's Vietnamese, um, so, yeah, anyway, and then I got my bivalent booster, um, like, right after, like, obviously my arm was very tender, it was very, like, I didn't want anyone touching it, and I felt like, my goodness, <laughs> I was in pain, um, so then, um, after the booster, I was just very exhausted, and I woke up, like, hot and cold, hot and cold, um, so, yeah, I took a nap after that, and then I watched The Serpent Queen, at night so that is pretty much the week in full i hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me and yeah i'll see you guys next time bye